Justin Burns is inside row number two. Bobby Glendale will be in the 111. He'll be on the outside. OJ White, number 94, will sit inside row number three. Outside him will be Ryan Worth of the 66W. The 17, Mike Greenfield, back in the white car this week. Mike Greenfield in the 17. And Jerry Charlo is in the number one team. Carlo just getting out onto the speedway in at the number one cage and he had debris here on the front stretch, so yellow flag did stay out on the racetrack. Do you guys want any Becky Becky? We already were here. Perfect, thank you. Have a good night. The white flag being displayed to the field as we get ready to go to green. With your marks are given GLC Real Estate Thunder Stock Division. I think 22. Tony Prezzo, your point leader coming into tonight with 558. AJ St. Mary has 472. Huh? Steve Smith, 446. Jerry Gilson, 458. Justin Burns, 418. Yeah. Tyler Collette has 382. Gilson. Scott Duffany, 332. Kevin Duffany, 291. Tim Greenfield with 290. And Justin Bolt rounding out the top 10 with 262. But as you said, Colby Goodale is in the 111 here tonight. That's the ride that Pop St. Mary's had for the last couple of weeks. He'll start outside row number two. Green flag is in the air. Stack them up three wide in the front as they work into turn number two. We almost had a four wide for a second. Justin Burns right in the middle of that in the number 11 machine down the back. Here comes O.J. White to the bottom. O.J. White in the number 94, just up the hill. Burns going to try to stick it down to the inside. Here comes the 22J of Jared Gilson. And they work up there four at the line. It will be O.J. White, the 94, out in front of the field. They take him off to the number two down the back stretch. They will head. Justin Burns into the number two spot in the 11 machine as they go to turn number three and four. Burns down to the bottom of the racetrack. Gilson to the inside track with Perkman outside him. Row number two as they come down the front track. Gilson is going to take the third spot away. He'll be the back in front of Travis Berkman. They switch lanes down to turn number two. Travis Berkman went to the bottom. Gilson 22J works to the top side as they go down the back track. Almost made contact coming off the turn. Gilson able to hold down to the spot. That's Mike Greenfield number 17 ride. Greenfield trying to close that gap. He's got the 1K of Gary Charlo on his back bumper. If they come to the cross flag, we are halfway home. Justin Burns, your leader. OJ White has the business back to third. This is Jared Gilson in front of Travis Berkman, Mike Greenfield, and Gary Charlo. As they'll work down to turn number three and four, watching this battle continue as they work off turn number four. Parallel flags are off the side. Burns is going to go way to the outside of the racetrack. And Justin Burns is Right back to the lead as he goes around the outside of O.J. White. They'll go off turn number two down the back stretch. Burns your leader. Now White second, third is Joe and Jared Gilson. Followed by Travis Berkman. White Greenfield now goes to the outside to Berkman number 88. Down to the turn number three and four. He'll drift to the outside. White flag will be coming out. As they come off turn number four, we've got a battle shaping up side by side for the third spot. Berkman gets to the inside of Gilson. Gilson to the outside. Tries to the top of turn number one. They'll go to turn number two. Berkman may have the advance. Gilson right there. Mike Greenfield trying to slide underneath them. If they go down into turn number three, your leader goes down to turn number four. This time it'll be Justin Burns. They'll bring him off the North End of Speedway. Checkered flag is out. Burns is the score of the win. OJ White moving second. Here's that battle for the third spot. Travis Berkman's going to come home third. Fourth will be Jared Gilson. He'll be followed back to the line by the Mike Greenfield number 17 with the 1K. Oh, but Gary Charlo. So very quickly, heat number one for the Marcia Gibbons TLC Real Estate Fund of Stock Division. Marcia Gibbons right there in Cardinal New York. TLC Real Estate Leader in Commercial and Residential Real Estate. Give them a call up there in Cardinal at 767 0095.
Second final qualifying heat again, four cars will qualify. 73 T, that is Tim Greenfield. He'll be inside room one. Outside him, it'll be AJ St. Mary in the 111 J. Tony Fresno, your points leader in the 22, will start inside room two. Outside him, will be the 61 of Jerry Rogers. Steve Smith, the number 16. And Ryan K, number 77K, or excuse me, 77G, are in row number three. And Francis White, back loose once again, in the number 60, will go shotgun on the field. 77G, Ryan Day, first time joining us here at the Can Ames Speedway in the 2021 racing season, starting outside last week's feature winner, that's Steve Smith in the number 16. Coming down into uh, turn number three and four, keep an eye on green flag will wave. He's got a good team. jump. Frizzle He's won there. two features in a row. He's going to drive up to spot number three. He'll get right in front of Tim Green from number 73. He's going to go up to Tim Green. He's right down to the bottom of the racetrack. White started shotgun on the field, and he's going to go to the inside. He's battling for spot number three. We'll try to get to those underneath. The 111 J of AJ St. Mary. Tim Green will get inside room number two. Outside him, it'll be Ryan Gay. Number 73. There is the battle for second, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth up here in the fourth. And down the front stretch, now there's a side-by-side battle in front of the field. Steve Smith to the bottom, slide job up in front of the 22 of uh, Tony Fresno. I thought you were only supposed to do that in sprint cars. I didn't know that you could do that in the four-cylinder. Little slide job action down into turn number two. Smith's going to hold on to lead. Tony Fresno knocking on the back door as they go to turn number four. Fresno goes a group higher. Swings way to the outside off turn number four. Delta comes back.